on everybody welcome back to another daily minecraft video on the channel i'm here where we left off now i don't know if you guys actually know what's been happening okay but i'm gonna run you down real quick so there's been a virus on my server that's right there is a virus who embodies a, it looks like an entity of some sort on this server and it's been following me attacking me it took over my account i captured it i quarantined it inside of this thing down here and it, fa it failed because then it rained and my firewall which i made to try and keep it out got rained on and it was weakened and then after that it got away and it multiplied and so far i haven't seen the rest of the multiplied viruses but they're out there so i don't know what's going on with that but i realized you know what i should probably be a little more safe so what I decided to do is making a safe dome. So I did that. I got a bunch of glass and I haven't really finished it actually. It's still got some holes in it, but I made a safe dome. So if you guys are excited for today's video, hit that like button, subscribe, turn on notifications and comment down below what you guys want to see me do next on this channel or even on this server. And let's get into today's video. So the first thing that I need to do is probably I need to uh, get some food because I'm hungry and I need some grub. So let's grab a little bit of what my farm has actually grown since the last time we actually repaired this. Oh, I don't think I actually got weed out of that. That makes me sad. And we're gonna re uh, replant all of this. Come on, these need to hurry up and grow so that I can actually get some more food, bro. I'm only gonna, what? I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get two bread out of this. Oh man, dude, I need to make, I need to make a more efficient system to make some food, but that's all right. We, we've got two bread out of this and and that is enough for now. Actually, let's just put the wheat in here. There we go. All right, let's get this bread and eat up. Uh, mm -mm, yum, yum. Okay. Oh, no. I'm not going to heal unless I eat the rest, man. I might need to get out here and real quick go attack some animals. And Oh, there's the virus. Hey, virus. What's up, buddy? You know, I was about to go out and get some food, but you're here, so that's wonderful. How you doing? You having a good day? Yeah, you having a good... Oh, you trying to break the trying to break the firewall? Trying to break the glass. Okay, that's all. Well, you keep it up, buddy, okay? Don't actually keep it up, though. Oh, dude because seriously I, I need to stay safe inside of here i'm watching you dude I'm watching you but yeah so i went out got a bunch of sand been smelting and i think i have two other stacks of glass inside of here let's see here yep there we go beautiful okay so what we're gonna do is with the rest of this glass we're going to uh close up the safe dome and then what i need to do is i need to like somehow figure out how exactly i'm gonna get out of here because the uh obviously if i close this entire place up wow this thing is really trying to get in here okay i should probably try and hurry up and close this up before he like figures out that he could maybe even jump in through here or something i don't know uh, then again it, it, i mean he can't really get past that actually no he could get past the firewall i just could attack him from the inside so if, if he gets gutsy and he wants to have another fight, then he could technically still find a way to jump through these holes and get in. So let's uh, let's let's do our uh, let's do our job and close this up as fast as possible, so that he can't do that. And then once I close this up, there's only one way out of here, which is that secret exit that I made. And it's a secret, but it is still a way to get in. So I'm gonna have to figure out a better way to get inside of here without secretly entering and exiting. I want to be able to know that I can just go in and out, but still have a safe way to do it. Boom, there we go. So we have a completely closed off dome. And I can look out and see that I have a spooky virus just looking in, trying to attack me. But that's all right. I don't really care. As a matter of fact, I think I'm going to go ahead and just close up the inside here with some glass. Because I have enough glass to, I think, do it all the way around since I already placed glass over there. So I have probably enough here, at least I hope. Yeah, there we go. I think that's that's it, right? That Yeah, that closed it up. Okay, beautiful. Nice. I, I can't really close this part up, but that's all right. Whatever. I just, I don't know. I don't want to accidentally throw something and, you know, things get caught inside of the fire and burn up and then I lose it forever and then it's sad and all of that stuff. So now let's actually go back downstairs. Hang on. Let's see how much. Okay. So I have a little less than a stack left of glass. Let's see how much, uh... Let's see here. Can I actually... I think I've actually already closed all of this up, so I'm not too worried about that. Oh, you know what I was going to do is I wanted to cover the top up. That's what I wanted to do so that I could actually freely move around here and still not have to worry about the fact that there's fire on top. I really hope I don't need that last piece of glass that I accidentally placed in the wrong area. Okay, there we go. All right. And the lighting is still nice, so we don't need to worry about that. Let's see here. I have enough, right? I really hope I have enough. I think I'll have just enough, and I'll have like five left. Five? No. Seven. Okay. I have seven things of glass left, so that was uh, that was kind of close. I don't have any leftover either, so that would have been it. 
All right, perfect. So we've actually used the rest of the glass and um, done with what we've needed to do. I'm just gonna break this piece of glass and just run down. Yeah, I think that'll. I think that works. That's nice. I like it. All right. So I've got my backup, my safety uh, area in the basement, all good to go. I could probably do whatever I wanted in here, but if you guys have a suggestion, then let me know. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna check. I'm gonna check if I have a bone in the chest. No bones. Okay. All right. I took my armor off, by the way, because I just wasn't sure. If I wanted to keep it, I don't have a lot more iron. I got more, I mean, I did go mining and everything. So I have 22 more iron, but I don't know if I really want to use that uh, that armor right now, especially since I'm not looking for a fight unless the virus is inside of here anyways. Having uh, armor outside isn't really going to do me much good. So uh, let's figure out how we can get out of here. But first, all right, I, I was about to say, but first we need to figure out exactly what the virus is up to. And how you doing, little buddy? Doing okay? You, you still can't break anything, right? Because that would be a big problem. Oh, yeah, okay, you can't break anything. All right, so now that we know for a fact that the virus still can't break anything, we are super safe inside of this dome and i'm super happy to know that there's pretty much actually no way for the virus to get in here because it, last time it wasn't able to break anything but it was still able to come in here and play around with my stuff and step on my crops and ruin them and, oh my gosh more food okay hang on let me grab this do 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 there we go yeah, I got another piece of bread, man. I never thought that I'd be so happy for just one piece of bread, but you know, I'm a simple man, dude. <laughs> okay, let's get rid of the right there. There we go. And we can get exactly one more piece of bread so we can fully heal up. Cool. Perfect. No, you're kidding me, dog. I just lost that half hunger. I think I'll still be able to heal. Let's just not move. Play it safe and see if I'll be all right. I think I will be all right. All right, perfect. Okay, so now we got to figure out how we're going to make an exit. I think I want to make the exit right here. Um, it's gonna be a little rough, but I think this is where I want to make this exit. So why don't we go ahead and get this iron? We are gonna make an iron door. What am I doing? I need to go to the crafting table to make an iron door. You silly goose. All right, so we got three iron doors. So let's put those. Oh, wait, hang on. No, we got to go back downstairs because what we're gonna do is we're gonna get some pressure plates here and we're gonna make the exit still down here. We're gonna make two exits. We're gonna make an exit still down here and we're gonna make it so that we're gonna let's see here let's put it ooh, where's the well, 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 what's, ha what's happening help cobble yeah wait okay i have regular stone either way but i, I forgot do it to make a pressure plate do i need regular stone oh i need regular stone okay good ooh, wow i'm glad that i actually thought that through yeah okay ooh, okay well i'm glad i have regular stone that works out all right so we got regular stone got the pressure plate Let's go ahead and just organize this inventory. We should probably patch this up just in case if the, the thing does actually figure this out. Um, let's just put the pressure plate down first and then <laughs> let's see if we can place this thing properly. Actually, wait, hang on. I need to place it like this, don't I? Let's see here. Perfect. Actually, no, not perfect. We need to move it back one. Let's actually, do I have stairs? No, I, I, well, I have this. I have one staircase. Okay, let's make one. Let's just make like, you know, just one more set of staircases here. Okay, there we go. Perfect. So let's get that, this here. Okay. And let's just go ahead and we're not going to cover, we're not going to break the fire, but we're just going to cover over the top right there like that so we can just get a nice staircase going. Ooh, I love it. Oh man, things are really coming together now. It's looking nice, you know? The basement doesn't look like it's just the nether, but under, you know, under the top floor there. It's, it's actually got its own, you know, its own personality going for it. Oh, let me make another staircase real quick. I, I got a little too carried away with making it look too nice. Okay, perfect. Let's go ahead and place it right there. And then uh, where's the stone bricks at? Let's just go ahead and place some stone bricks right there and right there. There we go. That looks nice. And then with that being placed right there, put that there, put that there absolutely beautiful so if i want to be able to go back in though that's a problem <laughs> if i want to be able to come back in then how are we gonna do that because i need to make it so that only i can get in you know what you know what we're gonna do we're gonna go ahead and make a lever because if i'm not here then i'm gonna need it open no matter what or else i'm just gonna be in trouble because if it closes on me it'll be closed on the virus but if it opens for me it opens for the virus, so I guess let's just have a lever here, and then if I go out, then I guess I just run back in and close it. So I'll just have to play it safe. Now, what I will do is I will make another... Just try to put a stick where it's supposed to come out. Okay, there we go. All right, so we got a lever now. Um, 
I'm gonna put another iron door right here. We're gonna put another iron door right... Actually, do I have torches? Yeah, I do have torches. Okay, let's place some torches here, first of all, because it's super dark. And let's place another iron door right here there and a lever he oh <laughs> i put it i put it one too far away there we go okay all right boom all right so run in close this one and then we've got a second safety right here and then we've got the firewall so hopefully that will actually work so we've got the safety dome now we have a way to get out of here and that is always good so i i did try and just hide it at first by just putting two uh polished andesite blocks here but i think this is a lot better because even though it's pretty obvious that there's an exit it's also much easier to access and on top of that what we are going to do is we are going to try and make another exit right here and we're going to try and do this properly i really don't want to mess anything up so let's get this right here there we go okay let's get a staircase right here and then we need to put a um let's actually just put it here i know that there's just a blatant opening right now but i don't see the virus so we need to just play it safe and do this while we can let's see here okay i placed it facing outward so that it actually the virus won't even be able to step inward on top of the firewall and with that being said we got it so i'm gonna wait for the virus to go away and i'll be able to fix the outside because on the outside i'm gonna i'm gonna actually have like another staircase uh so let's actually lead the virus to the other side here oh hi virus what you doing dude oh you're gonna try and get in here oh wow maybe try and get in dude yeah man dude that's you can do it okay go 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 come on and I really hope that there's no other viruses around here. All right, we did it. That is satisfying, guys. So we now have an exit as well on the outside. So if we really want to, we can exit on the outside up top here. Or we can go into the basement where we have the other exit just waiting for us. Just in case. And the virus still doesn't even know about this one. So let's open it up. And let's actually just double check to see where it'll go. Make sure that the virus has no idea. Let's see. Where's, uh, where are my dirt blocks at? Let's go ahead and just have that ready to go. Does the virus know? I don't think so. All right. Cool. And we only have these three blocks that'll look like dirt. But eventually it'll grow over again and look like grass so the longer i don't use the exit the better it will look anyways we'll close this up we will close this one up come on close up there we go oh man i feel so much more secure we're gonna eat this piece of bread i need to now start basically focusing on getting more food so i can sustain myself better look it's uh, the, the virus is trying to get into the door but i don't think it, it could figure it out i mean it's still above the firewall the door is above the firewall so uh that is still safe and we need to still figure out obviously if i can even destroy or defeat the virus or multiple viruses now i guess but either way guys that is going to be happening in the next episode we figured out how to make this dome completely safe and impenetrable so the next thing is how do we destroy all of the multiple viruses that have been multiplying in the world as well as i need to figure out a better food source inside so that i'm not barely getting by with some wheat although it does look like we can get more wheat right now look at that boom boom let's get this bread gamers bro oh my gosh look at that huh okay cool so we got four more wheat uh one more wheat we can make two things of bread dude we can make two yo oh my oh i'm a pro at this already all right we'll wait for I think that one's gonna probably need to grow and then after that we'll be able to get another piece of bread But I have one more backup piece of bread. So that is that is terrifying, but at the same time a little Oh, wow, it did it. Okay. All right. Perfect. Wow. I could just get I could just get another piece of bread now Okay, knowing that I'm not down to just one last piece of like food is is nice I might just try and go fishing But the thing is is I'm gonna need to be able to get somewhere without the virus finding me being confined inside of here is Kind of rough because I can't really go out and do a lot But it's also kind of nice and if I want to go mine I might just make a uh, staircase going further down and just mine in this area kind of make like a quarry So I'm still within the firewall, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed if you guys did enjoy this hit that like button subscribe Turn on notifications comment down below what you guys want to see me do next on the server If you want to see me do something for our on the channel in general, I hope you guys enjoyed Thank you so much for the support as always I'm your host saber and I'll see you tomorrow with another daily minecraft video. Peace